All right, uh, Budge and Homestead 35, Summer Garden. We did some changes since last season, and one of them is the watering process. Right there, we put a 20, flattened out some ground, put a 2,500 gallon water tank there. Came out of the bottom of the water tank and ran one inch uh, irrigation line down to the gardens, and we put in drip. And I'll show you, it's an irrigation drip system. And uh, it works so far really good because on the hillsides, trying to water, you lose a lot of water sliding off. So this just drips, conserves water, and waters the roots deep. And uh, this is corn in our pumpkins, and it's doing much better, much better than last year. Well, although we had a big problem with quail, uh, fucking voles, and other stuff eating our garden last year just because of the drought. But since we got kitty cats and uh, we set up traps... It seems to help on that. So let's go down. I'll show you the, the other gardens and how the drip system works. Uh, and these are our dogs right here. This is Bruiser. He's a Weimaraner. We just got them. He's blue. And this is uh, Indy. He's the gray Weimaraner. They're, they're half-brothers, and they're about 13 weeks old. But they're, uh, they're great. So we're going to go down the cart. Wait. Okay. All right, here we go. Quickly call, I'm running out of battery. Pull down there. We still have to fill the tank from uh, the other from the other well, and eventually we'll get some better uh, tubing on it. But here we are at the other garden right now. Stop, let me off. Stop! plant a little bit late. I wanted to get more in by May, but uh, you know, just you get so busy. But uh, you can see the garden's doing really good. And come down here, I'll show you how the drip system works. You can see our lettuce, cucumbers, uh, broccoli, cauliflower, and we got new rows of lettuce coming in, and the berries. And then we got squash. These are pole beans. Bush beans and soy. And again, we, we started them with the hoops. When they were small, we started what we could inside. But the bean ones, we started outside and we put the hoops up with some cover so you know the, the voles don't eat them. So this is how the drip works. It comes down here on the irrigation line, it's a one inch. And we put a T, and then I manifold each system, and then reduce three quarters. So you come off here, got a valve, and you can control it here. And then it just turns on. And these, this is the drip line here. And what it is, it has little holes in the top. You can see the water just dripping out. And you can run it, we ran it all the way down. You know, it's 120 feet. Right here, these are short, there's a lot more here. But normally there's just three going down. You can hear it filling up. And then it just drips real slow. And this is all gravity fed, so there's no pumps watering this garden. It's just a gravity fed comes down here. So I can water one garden at a time. There's three sections here, so one. And then I, then I turn that one off, water this one. Turn this one off, water the third one. Turn it off, and then I can water all the raspberries. Did the same on the raspberries. So this seems to be working a lot better than standing there with the hose again because of the runoff and then it's deep soaking, you know, down in the roots. And then we just feed them with uh, some sea kelp and fish emulsion and uh, rabbit poop. So they seem to be doing a lot better with this with this drip irrigation. And uh, what else was I going to say about it? Uh, I think it was, you know, one of the better investments we made, especially with the drought and everything going on. Uh, and it's really easy to install. You just, you know, roll it out, cut it, punch a hole in it. Uh, this is all from Dripworks. And then uh, all the seeds, again, are from Johnny Select. And, uh, all right, so that's our summertime garden and our new, our new puppies here. <laughs> it's been about a year since we had a puppy, so... They're learning, they're, uh, you know, meeting all the animals and 
chasing all the animals so they get used to them. <laughs> all right, so summertime garden. <laughs>